then to to to, to, to Nadia and uh, Aroboy mm. kama nilikuwa nimeropoka mm. eh mm. nitaropoka tu tell only that i'm not sorry <laughs> So I'm um, making this video to address Jalango. Hello guys, welcome back to Entertainment News. I'm your girl January Am. Nadia Mukami, Jalas na Aroboy. <laughs> Nadia Mukami wakio na Aroboy, they have never ever broke the internet wakiambia wa say that they are expecting. But who is Jalas? <laughs> Jalas na ye, akamua ape watu uhondo. And Arubo did not take that lightly. Um, akenda akandika hivi kwa Instagram stories zake. 2022, wanaume tupunguza mwishene bana. Biashara ikuhusu, achana nao kabisa. Shugulika na maisha yako. <laughs> Jalas decided to respond to that. Here is the clip. <laughs> <laughs> eh, 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 eh. I just want to focus. And you just want to focus. To focus on my own love. Tangu uitwe msema mushene. We. Na Arrow boy. Sasa unajua mimi niko tu hapa mimi naonga. Alikuwa ame jam for real. Mimi sijui kama ame jam ama jam. You didn't call him or I not... Sasa sasa nishaitwa mtu wa mushene. Sasa hata <laughs> hata nikimpigia na mwambie aje bro. Sasa ni wewe ndio unafaa ku jam when you meet with mtu wa mushene. Oh my god. Oh, Anasema uko na umama ama oh. what is it? No 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 sio mama. Ah. Uh. Amesema nime ni mimi ni eh, mama wa Mombasa. Uwe ninaombea. Uh na ni mdamu. Ndio bamburi. Baby girl. Ajo bamburi. Jo jo ado boy I mean you can chill ya ni bwana. Blogs is not about that. Uh, but then but then to to to, to, to Nadia and uh, Aro boy. Mm. Kama nilikuwa nimeropoka. Mm. Eh, mm. nitaropoka tu tena. <laughs> Let me ask you. Mnyenye mwanangi venye jalasu ni chomea. Unadhani you guys cannot be chomod for? Oh, but but set fire upon the mountain top. Uh, I'm telling you but sasa uh, sanifanye sa, nini bwana. Uh, Ibrolosi. Niliopoka ni, ni bwana. <laughs> Tutatengenesha bwana. <laughs> Unajitetea sana bwana. Oh bwana, tutatengenesha. I told you that I'm not sorry. <laughs> As you have heard, Jalas was so unapologetic kwa hiyo video. And Nadia decided to address him. Mm -hmm. Hi everyone. How, how's your morning? Mine is fantabulous. So I'm making this video to address Jalango. Because I don't want to write long text on my Insta story. Just say it once and for all. So he can read my lips. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to be a sober, respectful. I've never made a, a video addressing anyone. This is my first time and my last one. I'll never do it. But <sighs> what you did, I don't care how rude your follow-up video was. Was low, demeaning, disrespectful, period. Okay? So you invited us to your home. Number one, I was sick. I didn't even want to go. Okay. So our boy was like, ah, babe, ita ita kavbaya to invite you kwa mtu home kwake kwa privacy yake na hakuna tu tunafanya alafu tukose kuenda wewe jikakamua tuende. So I was like, ah, okay, so let's go. I I don't know. I was fifty fifty. Yani me my instinct. Hata na kumkani chelewesha kila mtu. My instincts to zika kuanga tu. Very right. So we go there. <clears throat> no matter the situation. Eh? If you've invited me. I think. That means that. You you trust me enough that. Me I never even knew you had kids. To be honest. Imagine if I went and took. A photo with your kids then posted it online because you've never posted because that's your private space and I respect your private space okay and I remember your kids are smart beautiful and stuff I would have taken a photo and posted like, ah, but then I made Nani's kids but I didn't do that because I'm in the limelight I know when someone chooses not to have a certain thing of theirs not put out there they have their own reasons 
they're protecting some some sort of their peace so i need to respect that you know hi ah. fast forward you said what you said and you're not sorry about it Arab boy everyone knows Arab boy is the least and problematic person that's wrong with him he's not dramatic at least i know he's not dramatic he's never had scandals he's never had drama so if you see him responding to someone it's because they've touched a, 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 a live wire that they shouldn't touch and yes you have your people coming through for you gassing you up at this point it's jalango 10 that in arab boy one one because it's jalango versus arab so i'm on team arrow so it's one all right people are gassing you up but i don't care how many people gas you up whatever you did was wrong it was just outright wrong just that was wrong to be honest if it was a blogger or someone <laughs> and if a promoter or a, a, like a fan i wouldn't even care but you invite to your personal space so that you can open your mouth then the least the, the next thing that follows is you trying to justify it and say you're not sorry you should ask yourself arabo doesn't pick fights but he's offended me i'm offended but me if i ever meet you i'm gonna tell you my peace of mind one on one we've been through a lot we have our own reasons as to why we keep our things to ourselves we have our angel ah, I don't cry. in heaven so you should have picked your I don't want to cry ah. I, 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 I don't want to mm -mm. you should have picked your phone called arrow boy and asked him hey Mbona watu wanasema hivi what you have to say bro nataka tukujua nini Because you never know why people do certain things Especially if you if it's fans I mean people have been talking people have been insulting and I've, we don't care we don't cuz sisi mimi na yetu najua the nigga lost his safari and lost his dad last year two people in a year So what she did, I don't care if the public thinks you're right, was low, cheap. God bless your ass.